The unofficial end of summer means we can all talk about all of our fall favorites like apple pie. Mm -hmm. We were just talking about apple donuts yeah. and apple cider. Oh, I like it all. <laughs> apple Hill just rang in its opening weekend. CBS 13 Shantae Passmore joining us live from High Hill Ranch with a look at how things are going out there. Shantae, great assignment. <laughs> I know. You know what's missing from that list, Tony and Marley? Actually, I heard of apple beer, so you can add that onto the list. And while it's just opening weekend, I'm told that business is already booming. Goodbye, end of summer. Fall is almost here. Oh, it's yes. wonderful it's weather. Beautiful. I'm not even breaking a sweat. From the smaller kids Hi. to the bigger kids, at High Hill Ranch, there's something for everyone. And we come every year, get our pumpkins, Christmas trees. Uh, it's just fun. It feels good. It's outside and it's nice to see everybody back out and about again. This pond was put in years ago. Second generation owner Jerry Visman agrees. Let's go back to last year. There was fires. Plus it was 104 degrees. Business was nil. While it's opening weekend for most of the growers throughout Apple Hill, High Hill Ranch opened earlier. The cooler weather, the long holiday weekend, and drought improvements are all major gains this year. It's been a while since the ranch stocked its pond with trout, a popular attraction. Undoubtedly, the storied favorites draw large crowds with orchard picking, yummy food and drinks. Yeah. Also, arts and crafts. It's the start of the season for us, so, you know, it's just a fun place to come. For growers, it's a place where families can savor sweet moments in the simplest ways. And as mentioned, this is a popular destination spot. And if you are thinking about coming up here over the weekend or during the weekday, we are told that you might want to consider, depending where you're going, like say, for instance, if you're coming to High Hill Ranch, which is where I'm at, you'll want to take the Camino Heights Drive. I'm told by growers that could actually help you shave off several minutes there. It's a tradition for whoever has this assignment to bring oh. back <laughs> apple donuts to the newsroom. Is that happening, Shantae, or are you just going straight <laughs> home? I can understand if you just want to keep it No yourself. pressure. Um, well, well <laughs> what had happened was I, <laughs> I started working and we I'm sorry, next oh, year. No. Next year, I got you next year. Next year, yeah, right. yeah. I'll take a keg of that apple beer, though, just for kicks. Yeah, right. why not? Thanks, Shantae. <laughs>